Whether it's your first time printing and you're unsure if the parameters are correct, or the weather changes and now the prints fail, or even when you want to print with a new resin without knowing the parameters, Frozen XP Finder is your best bet to solve it all. After printing, you can use it to see the printing performance. In this video, we'll teach you how to interprint, whether the parameters we use to print are correct, and what the graphics on the test piece represent. Observe whether the letters E and I is visibly printed, or if the holes are blocked. You can use this part of the model to find out whether the setting is overexposure or underexposure. Also, observe whether the smallest cylinder is printing out, or if the cylinder is too thick. Use this to find out whether it is overexposure or underexposure. After confirming whether the exposure parameters are suitable, you can observe the circular slope in the middle. The slope can show the performance of different layer thicknesses. Lower layer thicknesses will create a more detailed display, but take longer to print. After observing the performance, now let's pay attention to the textures of the four corners. This simulates the printing result you can get when you print a real model. The texture in the upper left corner can simulate different cloth textures presenting on the model. While the texture in the upper right corner can simulate the texture of different weapons on the model, such as the handle of the knife and the details of the cannon. The texture in the lower left corner can simulate the texture of different reptile skins. And lastly, the texture in the lower right corner simulates all the different details in jewelry. And now you've learned how to use the XP Finder. The parameters measured are in line with the general model printing conditions, but the size, weight, and shape of the model can still affect the final printing results. If the printing fails, readjust the parameters to improve your printing. If you are using a Sony Mega AK to print a model larger than 30cm, please refer to the Sony Mega AK tutorial in another video. And now it's your turn to print your own XP Finder. And that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.